Cause it all open like you got a slow leak I've been in the Stomach on flat, ass obese Walk on how the fuck you got in those teens I just wanna touch you, fuck you, OD What's up guys, so it's your girl Juicy here. I'm sorry if I sound a little off today, but my voice is a little bit hoarse because I was out in New York this weekend and it was snowing and anyways, but that's neither here nor there. Oh, I hate being this type of person where I have to do a review on something that I purchased and I'm unhappy with it because I usually just want to give shine to the people do I feel you know, you should go out and buy things from them or whatever the case might be. Don't get me wrong, within this review, I'm not telling you not to order from this company. But I just want to bring awareness to the company and to people that are shopping from them. You know, what to expect when you get your package. Hopefully this message, this video gets to them and they get the message and it doesn't happen to anybody else. So, <clears throat> For New Year's Day, I attended a New Year's ball. It's called Chic. It happens in New York City or whatever. So all the females dress in gowns, the men dress in tuxedos. It's less a lit event. Hey, 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 get it. from the website called poshbyv.com they have an instagram you can check out the instagram they have some really nice products and dresses and clothing clothing and all of that the pros part of it basically obviously when you make your purchase or whatever them taking the money away from you out of your account it was snatched honey just snatched okay they just everything was gone to give you your tracking information and shipping and all of that that was within a day or so to process the order so that came right away and also shipping said between two to four business days so they held true to that my item was ordered on tuesday and it was delivered on the saturday so it worked out all right Here's where the issue lies now. I have a P.O. box where I live. When I looked at my email the day my items was delivered, it said your items have been sent to the post office um, because there's a signature required, right? So first, I'm getting upset because I'm like, okay, USPS, I have a P.O. box. How am I supposed to stand there and sign for my item if it's a P.O. box? It's not like you come into my house delivering the stuff, you're going to a P.O. box. I'm not standing there so that was annoying so I'm thinking that it was USPS that did that but when I went to the post office they explained that the company is who does stuff they require you to sign for your package to state that you have it I'm not mad at them for that but I wish there was a way for me to know that like on the website okay remember I live in Pennsylvania I need to go to New York in order to do whatever it is that I'm doing okay it got delivered the day before Christmas so and I didn't find out that it got delivered the day before Christmas until I got to until I got to the mailbox. And when I get to the mailbox, they're telling me that it's not even in my mailbox. I need to go to the post office in order to get it. The post office was closed by the time I got there. And then it said that I can't get my package until December 27th because the post office was closed both Sunday and Monday because of Christmas. Come December 27th, I get the package or whatever. It comes in a basic standard USPS box. All right, cool. I'm like, okay, this is my stuff, my address on it, everything. All right, hurry up and get home now. Bust open the box. And my dress is basically inside the box. Let me show you. All right, so the box came like this. Or whatever. Oh, don't mind that. But the box came like this. Of course, it was closed up. And just so. So I opened it or whatever. And my dress is just inside like this. And to me, that's an issue because my dress has like beads on it. You know, like little crystals and stuff. So I felt that when they packaged my item, they should have at least put it inside of, you know, like a plastic bag. So when I'm taking it out... The beads aren't being, you know, rubbed across the box and able to bust off, right? So anyway, 
the dress was just in there folded and wrapped up rolled up or whatever and just dashed inside the box like that so i'm like okay so that's one thing that pissed me off so i take the dress out now or whatever i take the dress out and it was like so well it wasn't on it wasn't inside out it was actually right side out like this and when i take it out jewels the jewels that was on my dress were off like while i'm pulling the dress out they're just dropping dropping all i'm hearing is like that on the floor all of these jewels is dropping off my dress so i'm like okay all right this there's a lot of jewels on the dress so you know i'm missing one two it ain't that serious but then in the same breath i'm like no we paid over 200 dollars on this and stuff is just dropping like that's that's not okay so anyway so i go now and i put the dress on i ordered a size medium usually when i buy stuff i'm always a size medium or large but being that on the website it said that the model was wearing a size small and she did look pretty petite but she had like a big butt like you know one of those fake butts or whatever so i'm like okay if she could wear a size small then i could fit into a medium whatever and if i got the large it probably would have been way too big i was wrong because oh yeah that's another thing on the website there isn't a sizing chart so you know you just gotta go off the whim i put the dress on now and it just did not the zip on the back was like no bitch <laughs> no bitch so i said oh my god mind you this is december 27th the party is on january 1st i live in pennsylvania the party's in new york how you know like how am i gonna get this done or whatever so anyway i ended up going to a tailor the following day and i just told him my issue my issue and i said um i have this dress the zipper is just look again more jewels is definitely dropping as you can see look you can see this here hanging off threads more jewels again hanging off okay um what else it's just the jewels just just busting off the dress like and this is how the dress was sent to me like it's not because i went out and oh i partied in the dress or anything like that that's exactly how the dress came i even emailed them about it i emailed them and they said that i would have to pay I think some type of shipping fee to send it back to them and then once they get the dress they'll send me out another one it was December 27th if I send the dress out the dress is coming from California I gotta wait another three to four days then y'all gonna send me an no how is that gonna work so whatever anyway back on the story with the tailor so I go to the tailor and I said to him look I have this dress and the zipper isn't um the zipper isn't good he did was he just made it a corset as you can see like I said I'll just insert pictures for you guys but yeah he made the back into a corset for me in order for the dress to close up all right one two three okay all, all right that's good yes mm -hmm. you sure it's, it's great <laughs> oh, yeah. back to the sizing now so being that I ended up getting the size medium by my thighs were was super duper tight and it was pretty uncomfortable but i looked at the picture again online and the model like by her thigh area as well it was like a little bulging part there because like like the material there's no stretch at all in this like no stretch whatsoever so it kind of bulges so if you have thick thighs or whatever like me you have to um you would have just had to get a size up but again i would not have known that if there was a size chart i would have known that if there was a size chart on the website and i you know was knowledgeable of how to order from them so basically i'm doing this video just to say posh by v y'all got me all the way messed up because I shouldn't have to go through all of that for a dress that costs that much money you get what i'm saying and i don't think it's right that you guys package my item without care like y'all just dash it inside the box and just sent it on its way like 
it's coming from wherever it has little jewels and stuff on it regardless if it's seven jewels seven jewels ten jewels or even two that fell off that's not fair like people pay their money for a certain type of quality for their things and when they get it it's like you know there's no there was no care no cater to no nothing and i don't think that's right um i also feel like on you guys website you need to update it as far as having a size chart because i'm here just playing freaking monopoly like oh can i fit a medium can i fit a large can i this can i that and it's like i end up getting the medium and i had to go and customize the dress because i ordered a medium you know and i think it would be better if there is a sizing chart people would avoid these type of issues so the packaging yeah that's one thing that really pissed me off the size chart and also the option to sign for your package you don't need to change that but you need to let it be known to customers that you know if when i'm delivering this a signature is required you need to put that somewhere on the website that when you guys deliver your stuff via usps a signature is required so that we know if we should just have it shipped to the post office or if we should just have it or if we should just be waiting at our mailbox you know for when our package gets delivered to save any trouble because i don't know what would happen like if the event that i need to go to was december 29th and i got the dress on december 27th no the dress came december 24th i can't pick it up because by the time they deliver mail to my house it's too late for me to actually check the damn mailbox you know like i just feel like it needs to be some form of consideration and some form of better customer service happening on that end and um that's pretty much it for the most part um i did feel like i looked gorgeous in my dress um it was a part of my birthday celebration as well so thank you for helping to provide me with a fleeky dress but in the same breath you know the negatives kind of like outweighed the positive just a little bit but um yeah that's pretty much it they like I said, this is not a video to bash the company or anything like that. It's just, I just want to bring awareness to packaging and just, you know, just thought. Like, look, the bead is dropping off. 